Welcome back, guys. <laughs> I've loaded up some more mods. Oh, yeah. Because it seems that you guys kind of liked all of these awesome mods. These, these trains here, these are a bit boring, though. So we need to do something about that. So let's, let's, let's see. Let's see what we can do. So uh, let's not start with Chudley Goods. Let's start with, uh, what's this one? This is, oh, that's, it. well, yeah, I guess we could do, I guess we could do that. You know what? We'll do we'll do those, but I want to do these first. Yeah. Well big goods. <laughs> I love that name. Well big. Right. So let's uh, let's see what we can replace these with. So we're running what? We're running two one eights. Yeah, two one eights. So let's get rid of all these box cars. A hang on a second. Bef uh, I didn't want to do that. These. I'm pretty sure that this is two forty. These trains. Yeah. I'm, I'm certain they're two forty uh, length. So uh, let's um, I want to put that on. Right, so what are we going to put on here? So let's see, what have I got now? <laughs> let's go down here. Oh, look at these. Awesome, aren't they? I love them. These will transport uh, livestock, livestock, grain, plastic, oil, construction material, uh, machines, tools, food, and goods. Uh, so quite a few things. Now, they, we're using these for food and goods up and down here. But there is oil. Um, there's no... F no, there isn't. No, there isn't. There's fuel on this line. So it won't uh, It won't ship that. So that's good. So let's see. Um, like, if we were to put, like, I don't know. Uh, now, this is... What's the difference between version 1 and version 2? Uh, well, I, I guess it's just... It's just, oh, it's just the slogan that's written on the side. Okay, that's fine. So let's, I don't know, let's have, uh, what do you think? Like a couple, eh, a couple of those, then one of those, three of those, a couple of these. That's a bit too much. Uh, let's take one of those off. Let's take one of those off. 225, and then if we put a 218 on the end, add 242. It's too long. It's too long. That would actually cause us a problem. I had a problem on this line uh, when I swapped the um, the oil tank cars. The, the trains were 242 meters, and it was causing a problem. So one of these needs to go. I guess one of these. There we go. So let's say replace now. Yes. Right, and then let's see what they look like. So train 76. You're going to be the one that we look at. Definitely getting a lot brighter with all the new stuff that we're adding. It just looks so much better when you run into a station and you've got those nice tank cars there. So let's see, what do these look like? Oh, yes. Much better. Much better. Loving it. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause. And we'll go and have a little look at these up close and personal. Look at all the detail on them. Look at all that. It is, it is kind of staggering, isn't it? I love all this. I love it. Transwagon. Now, that's not the only stuff that we've got. Oh no, oh no. Now, um, now we've upgraded the tank cars. Now, what can we do about the state cars? Now, these state cars are shipping uh, construction materials, aren't they? Yes, they are. Well, I think we can. Uh, I think we can do do better than those. So let's have a look. Um, well, big, well, big crude. Um, this isn't crude and CM. This is actually fuel and CM. Should change that. Let's get it the right way. Fuel and CM. There we go. So, uh, what are we going to replace these with? Well, let's see what we've got. So, uh, there's four state cars. You know what? Let's just one, two, three. Let's whip those off. And let's see what we've got in the way of new state cars. So, we've got those. Then there's all the tank cars. And there's, there's a bunch that I haven't even used yet on the tank cars. I've got, but I've still got others done. Now, look at this. The, the Doppelstock container wagons. Now these are these are fictional. Um, these can't be used in, in Europe because of the the height of the catenaries. But um, the idea is that you've got this 
um, this chassis in between the in the, between the bogies, which is lowered, so that you can double stack these, so that you have one, which is you can see it's down the bottom of that container is down the like level with the kind of the middle of the bogies, uh, and then there's room to stack another one on top. So um, so I thought we'd use those because those look great. But there's also these, which are just um, uh, single single stack ones. So I thought um, let's see. These are these are higher capacities, but they're bigger. So I am thinking. Let's well, let's see what we can get on. So if we added like uh, one, two, uh, if we add, uh, let's see, if we add a two one eight on the end of that, I think it's going to be too big. Let's see, where are we? Two one eight. Add yeah. So we're going to have to drop. Well, I think we're going to have to drop a tank car. Um, oh no, hang on. I didn't remove that. Ha! <laughs> so it does fit. Hooray! And there was much rejoicing. So we've got here. We've got three of those. And the, what's the capacity on that? All the way down. Uh, capacity on that is thirty-one to thirty-four. Yeah, which is considerably more than thirteen. Yeah. So that should actually um, increase our um, our capacity on the line. So that's good. Um, what's the capacity on these? These are these are thirty. And they're shorter than these, so these are even more. Good lord. Okay, right. So, um, so we're, right. Well, we'll just do that for now. Boom. So replace those. Go. Ooh, can't wait to see this. Let's go. Let's go up this end of the train. Oh, look at these. Are they going to load up with something? Oh, get out of the way. <laughs> we want to see. Want to see this stuff? Nope. Now, why hasn't that loaded up with anything? Maybe, maybe it will at the other end because it's it's bringing goods up, isn't it? From uh, from down here. Yeah. Let's uh, let's go down here and see. Oh, so we got one of them coming in right now. Mind you, there's nothing there's nothing to take. What's at the station? There's nothing here. We need a we need a, one of these container ships to come. Oh, are you just arriving with fuel? Yeah, you, you're just arriving with fuel. You're just just about to bring in. Oh no, you're bringing fuel. Oh, you're bringing food then. No goods. So have we got any? Any? We got any goods? Let's see. So he's unloading all of his stuff. Flips around. Got any goods to load? No, no goods to load. That didn't bring any goods. Are you bringing any goods? Yeah, this one's bringing 37 goods, so we might actually see the thing with some goods on it. Uh... Oh, this one's this one's coming in. Now this is this is just state car. Um, but I've got to say I didn't like these these other ones. So now oh that's bringing the construction materials in from over there. Did I, now, hang on a second. I wonder. Let me let me have a look at this. Let's see. Did I? Because I, I looked at so many mods. I don't even know what I've loaded up and what I haven't. Um, let's see. Let's see what options I've got um, for various things. Uh, ah, now we've got these ones. Now, these will carry construction materials if I wanted it to. I, the thing is, I quite like them. Maybe, maybe we do 50-50. These are the sliding wall Wagons. <laughs> I'm not even going to try and say that. Uh, so yeah, we could we could put some of these on. Like we could have like 50-50, couldn't we? That'd be all right. So what? I might take some out. No, uh, I was going to say maybe take some out in the middle. What even like? So so I don't know how many we've got on here, but like we had like four. Take off one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we've taken off ten. So like six and four. So if we put like I don't know. Um, well, we could just put like one of each, couldn't we? Yeah, what the hell? What's the capacity compared? These are 13. These are 12. Okay, so uh, one of those, one of those, one of those, one of those. Just to mix it up a bit. How does that look? That looks okay. And then we put... Um, I was going to put six on, wasn't I? Um... Yeah, let's put an, let's put another one of those and another one of those. 
How's that look? That looks all right. And then I want four of these. One, two, three, four. Um, these are obviously shorter than the state cars, so we can put more on. So let's take let's take those state cars off. Let's squeeze on. I don't know, let's, let's put another couple of these red ones on. I like the red ones. <laughs> let's put another couple of those on. Then we'll try and get the state cars on. Please tell me this was a 320. I'm sure it was a 320. One, two, three, four. Right. Right. And then if we stick... Um, what did this have? This had a 246 on it? Was it 246 this had on? I think so. Just go down the other end. Yeah, it was a 246. Right. Replace those. Yes, please. Go. So, this pulls in. Get rid of this one. We actually want to be at this end, don't we? Oh, it's all starting to get a lot more interesting, isn't it? Love that. You know, I'm, I've got to say, I'm kind of tempted to replace this with... Um, with, like, all of these. They are freaking awesome. Let's go over to the construction materials plant where these are actually filling up. So, you've just filled up. What are you carrying? You're carrying 136. You've got room for a little bit more. But obviously, these are carrying construction materials, which they can, which is what we wanted. But I, these just look great. I love those. Oh, it's like everything's getting like a lot more interesting. This has got to upgrade. It is a shame that you like there is no way to kind of randomise the wagons in some way. Because like when they pass each other and they're identical, like okay, like here. When they pass each other and they're identical, it's kind of obvious that they're identical. That's the only problem. I should, you know, I'm looking at this, I, I think maybe I should change the layout of this. Let's change the layout of this, because I think this would actually be better if um, if we took these state cars off and just had all the state cars together. I think that's a better, I think that's a better idea. So, uh, what do I want? I want another four state cars. Oh, all the way down the bottom. God, I've got so many of these now. Um, one, two, three, four. Now, there's a, there's a mod, which I haven't loaded yet. Um... There's a guy called Nafis. Nafis um, sent me, um, he actually sent me a message and said, um, I've created a, a new state car that will carry anything. Um, would you would you take a look at it? And I have, I've had a look at it and I think I am going to load it up because it's kind of interesting. Um, so yeah, look forward to that. So we'll, we'll, we, and, and there's several other state cars I was looking at, but I, I'm not doing the state cars at the moment. So we'll look at that. We'll look at that in the future. So state cars are coming. So um, so Nafis, I am, I am going to, um, upload your mod and we'll, we'll, we'll see. Right, uh, what the hell was I doing? I was putting a 246 on the end of this, wasn't I? Yep, that's right. Replace now. Yes. I think that'll look better with the with the box cars at one end. Let's see. We got... Uh, oh, no. Uh, here we go. Oh, it's too late for that one. Uh, let's go to the other end. Uh, no, no, that's Eastbourne. Biggles Wade. Yeah, there's one coming into Bickles Wave right now. Perfect timing. Now, uh, pause, because I want to see which which are the which of these trains that need upgrade. Oh, it's the Bogner trains need to be upgraded. Well, you know what? Boxcars. We can go and do that. Yep, yeah, okay, cool. Let's see what this looks like when it's upgraded. And the doors actually slide. Look. Oh, it's changed it around. The doors actually slide open. How cool is that? Yeah, I think that's better with the box cars all together and the state cars all together. Cool, sweet. Right, let's go. Um, let's go to Bogner then, because these trains need to be replaced anyway. So this is that's Bogner, that's Cheshire Goods, but yeah, it's all these these goods trains and whatever up here. Man, they they look so like once you've seen these these kind of mods, it's like these trains look so boring. Well, not these ones. The um, the box cars. Where it's, it's like just box cars, 
and it's just these brown box cars, which which are really cool, like the first time you see them, but a bit of variety would be nice, wouldn't it? So, let's get on and do it then. So, uh, Bogner Food, here we go. You're just pulling out. Bogner Cow Food, replace. What are we gonna have? So these are, these are 320s, aren't they? Yeah, these are 320s. Oh, we can have some fun now. So let's get rid of all of that stuff. Now you're carrying livestock. Ooh, now, I don't know whether these ones carry livestock. We'll have to have a look. I don't know. I don't know. I know they carry food. I don't know about livestock. Oh, they do carry livestock. Awesome. Um, I think we'll have... So I'm tempted to just go with this one. I do like this one. What else? Uh, it's just, uh, those are the only ones I've got. Now, hang on. What about these double stocks? These do, oh, these do grain. They do do food, but they don't do livestock. Oh, we're going to have to, we're going to have to use those. Now, hang on. They do construction materials. Oh, oh, we could replace the state cars with those. Oh, that's it. Kind of interesting. All right. Well, let's do these ones then. So these ones. We're gonna well, okay. These we're gonna just have these, I think. Um, so I want to go out to like what's about two uh, two ninety eight might just work. With um, we're gonna we're really no habs on here, aren't we? Oh man, should we upgrade? No, you know we're out in the sticks. Let's stick with the no habs. Let's uh, let's this will be no hab country over here, and I don't care who says no. Don't use no habs. I I want to use no habs. Although I must admit, I nobody's left me a comment that don't use no hab, so I don't know why I'm. I don't know. I'm just sensitive about them. people. Will be like, "Those old train, stop using them." Right, we have to pay 100 million. Don't care. Uh, replace now. I just did that. Idiot. Go. <laughs> um, right. So, when's when's the next train? Here it is. Train 84. I need to do another live stream, don't I? I need to do another live stream so you can get your names on all these trains. Can we do a live stream? We kind of got look at all this. Awesome. Oh, I need to put some farmland in, don't I? Oh man, I completely forgotten about that. Oh, need to do that. Need to do that. Oh, there we go. So now we've got these shiny things for the cows to ride in. Oh, the cows will be happy on their way to the slaughterhouse. Yeah, yeah, I'm being killed, but I got to ride on this really cool train. Oh, come on, guys. That's a pretty freaking cool-looking train, isn't it? Oh, man. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Freaking loving that. Uh, right, let's, uh, let's do these guys down here. Did I turn the auto-replace on? I can't remember whether I did. Uh, so, auto yeah, I did. So, these ones, now these ones. Ooh, I don't know what we're going to do with these. Uh, pause. Let's have a look. So, we've got the um, the regular box cars. They're 230 in length. They're not top and tailed. And we're using 218s. Now, let's see. Uh, let me see about this. Because 218. 218, top speed 87, 3,400. Now, no have is only 75. That's 3.6 million. This thing's like six. It's twice as expensive. But these are smaller. You know, I'm kind of wondering. You know, I'm gonna switch, I'm gonna switch these to no habs on this line. Because we're using three 218s in other places. So yeah, I'm gonna switch I'm gonna switch to no habs. So let's get rid of those. Let's have, uh, but but I'm going to put a no hab on either end because then I can have them top and tail, and it's the same cost. Okay, they run slightly slower, but like who cares? So um, we're going to have no hab with um, these ones. I think we're going to use kind of a mixture of one, two, three, four. These are two forty inlets. So if we have like four of those, and then a couple of those, a couple of those. That's 205, and then we slip an, a no-hab on the, on the end. 
Uh, we could probably get, I don't know, can we squeeze one more car on? Yeah. I think we could probably squeeze one more car on. Two, yeah, maybe, maybe. Let's have a look. No, uh, I don't know. I have, no, 248. No, it's too, too big. Too big. So, yeah, we'll drop that extra car. 225, that's fine. So, replace. And, yes. Right, go. So, come on, game. So, these guys are running up to here. So, this will come into here and upgrade. And we'll have a look and see what it looks like. Um, I did do a couple of things before I started this episode, by the way. I did, I was having a run around. I did some messing around with terrain and stuff. I also upgraded some of the tank cars. You've got to flip around because the yellow cars are at the back. There we go. How do these look? Hell yeah. That looks freaking awesome. Love that. Okay, that's those. Uh, oh, I didn't do the... Uh, I didn't set it to auto-replace, did I? No, I didn't set that to auto-replace. Right. Uh, these ones. Let's do these ones next. Bogner Fuel. God, this is fun, isn't it? <laughs> so what have we got? We've got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight state cars. And six tank cars. So let's take... Take the state cars off, take the tank cars. Oh, and it's it's not top and tailed. Well, I want to top and tail everything pretty much now. So we'll have, um, we'll stick with the no-hab. And then, boom, 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 what do I want? I'm going to put like, one, two, three, four, five, six of those. And then let's have some of these. What haven't we used? Let's go down. Let's use, I used some of these in, my, in the last series. Let's use, oh, let's use some of these. Some of these are not, these are new ones. These ones. Um, let's have, I don't know. Let's have like, I think we were using like six cars, weren't we? So like, like one, these, lo these might be longer though. What if we use like three. Now let's use two and two of those. One, two. Right, that's 227. And then I stick a no habit on the back of that. 246. Uh, well, I think we're going to have to drop one of these then. So let's drop one of those. 223, that's fine. So we'll replace now. Yes, please. Go. Alrighty. Oh, man. Like, how much better is that? Just staggeringly good. Oh, man. And there are so many of these to do. I guess I probably should do some offline. You know, I'll, I'll ask you the question. I, I'll, so I won't do it. I won't do any more of these. And I'll say, do you like, do you, do you like watching me replacing these trains? Or would you rather me do something else? Um, if I think about it when I release this video, I'll actually put a poll up in the top corner. And um, you can voice your opinion on whether you want to see these. See me replace more of these or not. Right, that's enough of that though, because we've, we've spent quite a bit of time on that. What are we going to do? I know what we're going to do. Um, I'm going to put an airport in Maggle. Pause. We're going to put an airport in Maggle. Oh yeah. So, um, I take that out. Take that out. This is kind of Maggle Main Street, isn't it? Where's, where's the bus? Oh, now nah, the buses are there. Okay. So what I'm going to do is grab an airport and this is going to be a large airport with three terminals. Going to flip you around and I want you to go in there. What are the chances of being able to get this thing in here? Well, I can tell you they're pretty good because I've actually tried this. <laughs> I, did, I, was, I was looking to see where I could get it. See, I can get that in. Uh, it knocks down all, the, all those buildings, but I don't care about that. So there that will do Oop. yep that'll do pig in it goes now i think uh, i think this needs to be flattened a little bit so that the planes don't fly through it so i'm just gonna have a, a quick 
Oh, let's get this up to high because it'd be, be quicker. There we go. Right, how's that? Yeah, much better. Much better. We'll just take a little bit off there. And that should be, yeah, peachy. Right, let's level this off just a touch. Just so it doesn't look ridiculous. We'll leave it, I think we'll leave it a little bit lumpy and bumpy though. Maybe, maybe take you down a touch. You do look a bit silly. And there we go, come on, go down, go down. Come on, auto save, go away. I'm busy, I've got stuff to do. Right, and there we are. Oh, these trucks. Those trucks need to be replaced, don't they? Right, let's get it. Get it out of there. Right. Yes. The rest of it, I'll sort out offline. Okay, so we've got an airport. Okay, well, yuppie freaking do. Uh, we've got to get people to the airport. That's the thing. So, let's put in, uh, let's put in some roads. So what do I want? Uh, I want large street. Electric with a bus lane. So I'm going to bring that down there. Yeah, I quite like, to be honest, I quite like that to kind of sort of curve a bit. Let me put that in a little more like that. There we go. Makes it a bit more interesting. And that can come down there. That's fine. So this is going to go around like that. Okay, I want to do some upgrading now because I want. I want there to be two tram routes. One is going to go around the the city. Oh, ooh, now do I go around there or do I go through the? No, I go through the middle. I go through the middle. I go through here. Ooh, now I could cut down there actually, away from the freight station. Do I want to do that? I got to say it's kind of tempting. Yeah, go on. We'll cut down there. And then we're down there, and then boom, boom. So that's that circuit. Oh, I didn't do this bit, did I? No. Yeah, there we go. So now, uh, let's say no, no. And get rid of... But I'm going to upgrade this to large roads. That section around there. And probably this section here. Yeah. Oh, and I can't do that little bit. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, well... Actually, put the darn thing in manually. There we go. Hook you up and bosh. Alrighty. Uh, but as well as that, as well as that, we're not done. We're not done. Oh no, no, no. We're not done. We're also going to have a line that goes straight down the middle of the town to the main bus depot here. Um, and and beyond, I think. Oh, okay. I can't do that. So we've got to get rid of that. Okay, well, let's get rid of the depot. Uh, let's get rid of that. And then, uh, what was I doing? I was at Graham Rose, wasn't I? Yep. I uh, want to take this. Um, like, what the hell? Let's just let's go all the way to the end. Why not? Cool. So, at this end, uh, we want to put in a nice tram station for it to turn around. Because we're because we're nice like that, so flip you around a little bit. So yeah, don't. Yeah, I guess I'm not gonna. Fuck, yeah, don't mess around with it. Just put it in. Just put it in. Is what it is. Cool. That bit of road needs to be replaced because that's just silly. <laughs> that dip in the road, that's ridiculous. Let's get rid of that. And yeah, it's not it's not tram track, is it? No. Oh, okay. We can't do that. What is that? I guess that was me well. I guess that was medium that had been upgraded. So uh, we want no and no. Well, actually, we should change the keep keep, shouldn't we? Right. So uh, let's put that in. And then maybe we can upgrade that later. So let's smooth that off so it's not looking silly. All right, cool. 
see, like this bit, like that bit there needs to be relayed, really. But I don't want to knock all the blooming houses down. <laughs> there won't be any town left. Um, we'll get rid of that section and we'll put in um, a section across. Well, I will if I can put the blooming thing in. Okay. Like, really? Okay, well, let's do it. Let's do it that, like that. So. Oh, I'm trying to not knock that building down. Okay, let's bring that out like halfway. And then curve it in like that. There we go. Okay, cool. Okay, so we've got all of our tram lines in. Um, we need to put the bus station back in. And... Yeah, and that's basically it. Now, the thing is, like, are we going to have a bus station? Yes, we are, is the answer. Yes, we're definitely going to have a bus station. Um, okay. So the trams can go through here, which is really nice. I like that. The trams can turn around at that end. Now, the question is, what happens at this end? <laughs> well, <laughs> who knows? Who freaking knows what happens at this end? Um, now, obviously, it'd be really nice to put one of these in along this section. Uh, in there. Like that. Um, do you want it like parallel to that one? You're going to be really fussy. Oh, all right then. So we'll make it parallel to that one. So we'll have it coming straight out of there and curved at the other end. All right. Boom. In it goes. Cool. Those do look really good, don't they? Let's fix the terrain. Well, as best we can. Flush with flush. That's kind of interesting at that end. <laughs> yeah. Is that a little bit too interesting at that end? I, I think that might be a little bit too interesting. I don't know. I mean, I kind of like it, to be honest. But that is a bit steep for trams. <laughs> yeah. Little bit. We need sloped tram stations now. I think, you know, the weird thing is, I think I'm going to actually going to leave it like that. I mean, the alternative is that I put it on that side, which I could do. Um, you know what? I'll leave that there for a second. I'll try putting one on this side and see how it looks. So if I take that out and put one on this end. So it'd have to be... Well, I'd have to put it like pretty close. So if I if I did that like that, and then this, I chop that end off. Get a large street. Yes, yes. I, you know what? I'm now I'm tempted to have two stations, because I kind of like that. I kind of like how that looks. Yeah, go on. We'll do that. Let's get some lines and some trams running. So what do we want? We want one, two, um, we're actually going to want three because I'm going to have to do clockwise and anti-clockwise and there's no place for them to turn around. So yeah, we're going to need a third one. Uh, line manager and another one, please. Thank you very much. So let's get tram depot. Where are we going to put the tram depot? Maybe put the tram depot on the end here. Yeah, it makes sense, wouldn't it? Over, there, over here. Like that. Yeah, it works. Right, so what do we want? I'm thinking we don't want too many trams on here. So, what are we going to have? We're going to have the sit of this. Yeah, I think so. So let's have like one, two, three. Let's have I think four on the main run. So those will go on line one. Yeah. And then, oh, stations four and five are not connected. Maggle exchange and upper Maggle. Uh, oh, because I haven't electrified this. That's why electric. We only need one platform. Apply. There we go. Now it's happy. Okay. And then we want. What do we want? Probably. It's probably the same kind of thing. For maybe five. One, two, three. Four. No, I'm going to put four. Four going on line two, and one, two, three, four going on line three. 
Right, go. Let's close these down. Not ready. Now, I, I'm kind of tempted to color code these. So, let's see, line one. Um, what did that, what, I, I made them yellow, didn't I, when I did them before? The ones going to the station, uh, the airport. Did I do them like bright yellow or something? I kind of quite like them bright yellow. Yeah, go on, we'll have, we'll have bright yellow ones. And then the ones going around the outside, so line two and line three. Yeah. Even though they do go to the airport, they're kind of not really. Um, so we'll make these um, slightly. Ooh, no, that, I think that needs to be a maybe a, either a brighter red or a darker red. No, maybe a darker red. No, I can't say I'm massively keen on that either. It's because the green paint underneath stays there, and this is just overlaid on top. So getting the like the right like what if we now? Nah. Well, I quite like that. That's not giving me what I want. But like what doesn't what doesn't orange? Yeah, no, nah, it doesn't work. What about? No, that's kind of horrible. Well, I, I don't think there's a way of getting a nice a nice red. There just isn't. I mean, that's... I think that's probably the best you're going to get. So, yeah. Uh, I, I'm, I'm actually going to ditch it, and I'm just going to uh, make them yellow, I think. Yeah, that's not the yellow I want. That's the yellow I want. Yeah. No. Green. We'll go with green. So those are going to be green, and vehicles, those are going to be green. Okay. Go. Let's, let's see. Like, how ridiculous do they look going up here? I would have thought pretty ridiculous. Well, actually, you know what? Not as ridiculous as I would have thought. Only slightly ridiculous. All right, cool. So we've got those done. So the next thing to do is um, what airline is going to fly to here? Well, did you guess? It's going to be the Big Ash is going to come up here. Um, now, this is going to suck a little bit, I think, but we'll see. Oh, now I wanted to show you this. Oh, I'm glad I, I'm glad I thought of this. Um, I wanted to show you this. If we look at this, look at this. Big Ash is making a profit. How about that? It's actually making a profit. Uh, Big said Tav is not. Even though it's got more people on it, but it's got like twice as many planes virtually. Uh, but Big Ash is making a profit. Unfreaking believable! I was stunned when I saw that. Well, what we're going to do with Big Ash is currently it goes Biggles Wade, West Ham. It's going to go Biggles Wade, West Ham, Maggle, and then back to West Ham, which does mean that it does this stupid looping nonsense which is not great but you know what are you going to do um, I mean there's, there's nothing you, I can do about it. well the only thing I could do would be to put two airports in here and that's just not happening at least at the moment and I have thought about doing it I have thought about putting two airports in and routing this through the centre of them and all that kind of nonsense um, and it may still happen but we'll, we'll just try things out like they are for now so that's uh, that's how it's going to be that's how it's going to be so, go. Now, um, I suppose we should put some planes in at Maggle. Now, we've basically doubled the size of the route. So, um, we had seven airplanes on. I'm going to put another five on, I think. And I loaded up one new plane. Where is it? Oh, I loaded up Austrian Airlines, which we didn't have before. So, we'll, um, we'll definitely have a couple of Austrian. And uh, we'll, have, um, we'll have another another British Airways. And another... Scandinavian, and I guess, I don't know, what, another Lufthansa, maybe? Another Lufthansa? Yeah, go on, another Lufthansa. Right. And you guys go on to the big ash line. Cool. I'd be amazed if the planes don't fly through this mountain or something. I don't, I, well, I don't know, actually. Let's have a look at the line. No, because they're coming through here. That could actually be quite cool. Ooh. Depends if they fly through that mountain which that's possible. 
But then this part should actually be quite, quite nice. Oh, should we should we fly? Should we fly on the aircraft? Uh, is anybody coming up here? Doesn't look like it. Any planes at all? Okay, you're coming in. You're just going out. And where are you going? You're going to. Are you going to Maggle? Right. Well, we're riding on board with you then. Oh, we're on Qantas. They've never had a crash, Qantas. <laughs> definitely, definitely, definitely never had a crash. Charlie Burge. Right. So, let's see what kind of ridiculous route you take, Mr. Spirit of Australia. Oh, oh no, going this way, we just, uh, we land straight in there, I think. Yeah, it's taking off that they fly. Oh, so close to that mountain. Oh no, we go, where do we go? What the hell route are we flying? So we go up here. Then we do a 360 to land. Really? Okay. Hey, what it, like, whatever works. I just, to be honest, I, I, as long as the, the airlines make a profit... Right. I don't want to make loads of money off them, but I do want them to kind of, uh, well, at, at least kind of break even. Ideally, make like like a little bit of profit so it's reasonable, and then everything else is just the aesthetics of it. Here we go. Yeah, that's a bit of a stupid route, isn't it? Of oh, course, we will land with it, but that's, that's that's a bit of a stupid route. So you take off from here. You go over there, then you do a 360 and land like that. Why don't you just go like that? I guess it was too extreme for it. Where's the plane? There's the plane. We'll come in to land with it. Because let's face it, takeoff and landings are the best bits. Oh, come here, come here. Right. Our first plane landing at Maggle, I think. Maggle International Airport. <laughs> oh, the people of Maggle will be like, oh, we've got our own airport. Cool. Now, will we get any people? I don't know. It'll probably take a while to, um, to like get any like, reasonable amounts of passengers using this. Um, one of the problems is that Maggle isn't really connected to anything else very well. Um, so it's not connected to... I mean, it's connected to Settle by bus, but that's all. Uh, we're going to have to put in, I think, some... some trains. Yeah, we're going to... I think... I was kind of thinking, oh, yeah, am I going to do this in this episode? No, I, I, this episode is too long already, I think. Um, I The Red Arrow line... Um, these need to get replaced anyway, uh, and the, this line is hardly being used. Uh, if we look at this, where's the red arrow line? It's the red arrow. Here we go. Um, we got like 87 of 180. Uh, it's losing money. It's not doing that great. So I think what we'll do is we'll put um, we'll put some new trains on here, and we'll do what I was going to do, which is extend this into town. We'll have an underground station, and we'll just run that into town. I mean, it's either, well, it's either an underground station or an elevated station. I mean, I could replace this with an elevated station and have an elevated station. I don't know. If you've got an opinion on that. Yeah, if you've got an opinion on that, leave me a comment. I think we just do an underground station, personally. I think that would be probably better. Uh, but I was then thinking, well, you know what? We could extend the, the line to go... Um, from from Tavistock up to like Barking and Maggle. So it goes from Maggle, Barking, then Tavistock, and then over to Peacehaven. That might be that might be worth trying. What do you think? That's yeah, gotta be worth a try, hasn't it? We are getting look, we are getting passengers on these lines, which is kinda good. Let's have a look. Let's see how many passengers are we getting on these lines. Line one, two, and three, isn't it? Line one, two, and three. Well, we're starting to get a few passengers. 
that's good news because I would imagine the the, the passenger use the, the the population's transport usage. Yeah, I think I think when we started this, it was like three <laughs> percent. Well, we've already cranked it up to ten percent, so that's a big improvement. But we've got a ways to go. But it does mean now that if people want to come to Maggle, they can use the trams to get anywhere. I mean, this is a good transport system now, pretty much. If You know what? If we put another tram in that went across town, that went from like up here uh, and went down, maybe, I don't know, but, but went across this way. So yeah, it'd probably go around there and then across there. Um, then that would be a really good transport system. It's pretty good now. You got you got any passengers? Oh my god, you've picked up eight passengers. Unfreaking believable. I'm staggered. Let's have a look. We got anybody? Oh look, we've got people going to the we've got people going to the airport. And there was much rejoicing. I mean, this wear woman is wearing a a pantsuit from the 1970s, but but hey, I don't care. And we've got lime green trams. And you can't ask for more than that. So, and on that bombshell, we'll leave it there for this episode. Uh, how are we doing over here? Boring trains. We need to spice up more of our trains. Let's go over here. Have we got interesting trains? Uh, no. But if we go up here, we've got interesting trains. Yes! We've got interesting trains. I'll catch you for the next episode. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Peace out. <laughs>